All right, good morning all. Dennis here, back at you with some words of strength. We have a nutrition question this morning. So the question is, what makes you so convinced that meat should be included in the human diet? Let me introduce you to the expensive tissue hypothesis. So this hypothesis states that certain tissues in the human body are extremely metabolically demanding. Or in other words, they require a lot of caloric energy. For instance, the brain, which consumes about 20% of human energy, and the colon, which is also extremely metabolically expensive. Now, if we look at humans being primates and compare them to other primates, our brains are about three times the size, and our colons are significantly smaller. The human colon is about 20% of the gut, whereas a chimpanzee is about 50% of the gut. And so what this shows us is that humans, when we switch to an animal-based diet, we got a rapid growth in brain size. This is the leading hypothesis in why our brains expanded exponentially. And as a trade-off, we got a smaller gut. And this makes sense because we were eating less fiber. If you look at a gorilla, for instance, um, and we equated for weight, we would have to eat about 20 pounds of vegetation a day to get the same amount of energy a gorilla gets from its diet. Um, they have the colon to support that, but they do not have the brains that we have. So the expensive tissue hypothesis shows that because humans adapted to an animal-based diet, we got bigger brains and smaller guts. And it is what it is. This is what you're adapted to, and this is what your body now needs to thrive. All right, y'all, I hope that helps, and uh, give it a shot.